Miami-Dade County is looking after its residents this Thanksgiving. Fight the spread of COVID-19 with the new Combat COVID MDC mobile app. You can find this in the App Store. This app is designed so that if anyone in your party has a positive COVID test, you will be notified via the app, keeping everyone's privacy safe. So download the app today and enjoy a happy Thanksgiving. Hey everyone, Alicia Curry here. I wanted to just say happy Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving to everyone. Yes, Thanksgiving is going to be different this year and not just by a little bit, it's going to be very different for many of us. And I wanted to share some tips from Miami-Dade County uh, to help stay safe over the holidays. I love cooking my turkey. I developed a recipe, um, I think about 10, no, probably longer than that. It's probably been about 14 years ago and everybody looks forward to my turkey because it's juicy, it's delicious. I brine it, but only my family is gonna get to in, enjoy it this year. And I wanted to share some tips for you to stay safe over the holiday season. First of all, I wanted to say, assess your situation. That's the number one tip. Do you have elderly? Do you have people who are at risk? Anyone with an underlying condition that, that really you need to be careful of? because then you don't wanna introduce people into your home that is going to compromise their health. If you have a, a student coming home from college, you know what are the parameters that you're putting around to make sure that they are healthy and they are safe and the rest of the family is also healthy and safe. So make sure they get tested. If there's an opportunity for them to self-isolate while their results are coming in or just as a precaution, take advantage of that. Are we really willing to risk it for the brisket? Are we willing to risk it for the turkey? Risk our health, risk our safety, risk our family just to gather together for the holidays. If you do have family and friends that are coming over, there are some guidelines that the CDC have um, instructed. And, you know, we can still have fun, but be safe. So wear your mask, ask questions. Where have they been? What have they been doing? You know, make sure that it is a safe environment for people to come in, into your home, but also that they are following precautions so that they're not introducing anything into your home as well. Minimize the exposure to your family. The CDC also recommends that if you can do it outside and, and here in South Florida, we have beautiful weather. So if the weather is great, there's no rain and you have an opportunity, you have a backyard, celebrate outside, take, take everything to the backyard. If you don't have that backyard or an opportunity to celebrate outside, they suggest opening up the windows. Again, if the weather's great, open up the windows, let air circulate, wear your mask, stay socially distanced, minimize the, the number of people in the kitchen. They also suggest if people are coming over, have them bring their own meals, have them bring their dinner so that they can eat their dinner and celebrate with you, but not commingling a lot of, a lot of meals. Have a designated person to, to sanitize frequently uh, touch surfaces. So sanitize those surfaces frequently, wash your hands frequently, have some hand sanitizer around your home so that people can you know, use the hand sanitizer. There are opportunities for us to celebrate virtually. And I think that's where we're gonna have the most fun is to celebrate virtually. Zoom has been so generous that they have removed the 40 minute restriction on all, all Zooms on free accounts so that you can celebrate with your entire family for as long as you want on Zoom. You can play games. Okay, so you're not gonna have that backyard football toss, but you can play games virtually. My family and I, we play this online game. It's from jackbox.com. So you can go to Jackbox. There is a fee for it, but you can download the games. Everyone plays with their phones and we have hours and hours of fun playing that. So you can check that out. Um, you, you can also play charades. You can play Pictionary together. You can have a scavenger hunt. Have a scavenger hunt, hunt, have a list of things, fall items or Thanksgiving items or something that 
traditional that's traditional to your family and have them go look for it and have a scavenger hunt. You know, there are things that we can do to still make it fun and exciting and enjoy one another's company, even if we can't be there in person. The virus is spreading and we want to control the spread and we don't want to give it to our loved ones. So let's stay safe over this Thanksgiving holiday. Let's mask up, stay socially distanced, have a great time, get tested. MiamiDade.gov slash Combat COVID is an app that I would encourage you if you're going to have guests in your home to download because it maintains privacy. So if someone after the holidays does test positive, it will notify everyone who, who was there, but also keep your medical information private. It will let them know that someone who is there has tested positive and you should go get tested. So go to miamiday.gov slash combat COVID get the app. And that way, if someone later tests positive, you will be notified. Stay safe over the holidays. Have the best Thanksgiving under the circumstances. Happy Thanksgiving. I will see you on the other side of the holiday. From my family to yours. Have the best time.